Okay, so this is going to be a little series of videos on unboxing Stormy Texas. You see these unboxing videos on YouTube where people open up, a, you know, they order a phone, they open a phone, they look excited about it, it's a phone. Or they order a computer. They unbox the computer, and it's a computer. This is very exciting. So Stormy, I haven't seen him for a, about a month, but uh, he's been dropping me off things at the restaurant. We just our schedule hasn't synced up. Last time I saw him, he was riding around Nelson with a big fur hat and his little electric scooter. But I thought, this has got to be a more interesting unboxing video than most unboxing videos. Because with Stormy, you don't know what you're getting. You haven't a clue. You haven't a clue. I've gotten half-smoked cigarettes stuffed inside Hostess Twinkies. I've gotten, you know, old socks. I've gotten, well, everything. So. He's apparently been around a couple times. I haven't seen him either time, but he's left me a couple of packages. These are here. So one is a Monday size 7-Eleven cup filled with stuff. And the other is a book and uh, a bunch of other stuff. I have no clue. This is the stuff. This is my merch, my loot bag from Stormy, Texas. Quite possibly the greatest living artist in the Kootenays. Quite possibly. I'd even go so far as to say, undoubtedly. Let's see what he's gifted me today. I'm filming this in Calgary because like I'm either working doubles or I'm driving to Calgary or I'm driving back. So this is just the best it has to be, you know, sorry. So we'll start here. Got a note, apparently the server that took this um, says that I have to, I have some sort of pickup Dawn at home hardware downtown Nelson who knows what that is so would appear today everything came wrapped in a server's apron it's rare that he gives you anything you could possibly use this might be actually useful I'll have to take a look at it Let's take a look it will probably need to wash like most things that he's touched or been in close proximity to yeah it's a server's apron, but it's probably more for a girl. I'll pass it on to the waitress at work. Well, thank you, Stormy. Thank you. Thank you very much. Candace will appreciate that. Um, that's another thing that he does, and you'll probably see this in the course of my unboxing here, is that I get things and I'm supposed to deliver them all around Nelson to people I've never even met. Sometimes I know the people, sometimes I don't. You know, it's like a little uh, errand hunt where I have to take parcels to people that he knows or owes things to and deliver them. I'm his mailman. It's like that movie with Kevin Costner, The Postman, in the afterworld. Anyways, so what did I get here today? Oh, a bunch of stuff. Green bubble wrap and an inkling weaves by Neath Error, A Way to Understanding, includes thesauric dyslexicon. Thesauric dyslexicon. Truth can only be spoken by truth. There is no other way to say it. Likewise, does this book speak for itself with flowing words warmed up to paint vivid pictures of... Anyways, we can rest assured that Stormy found this in a free book bin somewhere about Nelson. Thank you, Stormy. I look forward to reading it. Oh, there's of course... Dollar pack of fags naturally mercy lightning rod. So... Everything has its price. I apparently owe him a pack of smokes for this unrequited book. You know, probably he's very upset because I've been so at delivering not having seen him for a month. Next thing is a strap holding together a piece of cardboard. Well, let's go to this. Because some of the things, you know, I hate to say it, I hate to devalue the work of a great artist like Stormy Texas, but some of these things, of enormous value. Hard to believe. This happens to be a uh, coffee sleeve and it says on it, printed stack, glucamine, clear lake, stormy Texas plus Norma J. I'm going to show it to you if you can make heads or tail of it. Go home and then I'll read it to you. How about we just do that? This is a scroll. It's from the same 7-Eleven coffee cup. Pointed stick. 
Lucerne at Clear Lake. Stormy Texas, that's the uh, simple, plus Norma Jean, plus Mae West, who found? Pump, lipidant on log. Elephant. Who found? Poop elephant on log. Savvy Davis Jr. carved stick, plus Norma found stones, plus then who did assembly? One, God, two, Moe's, three, Stormy Texas. I'm gonna say three, Stormy Texas, assembly, whatever I'm about to unpack here. I got a little crack up popping candy. It feels like it's the uh, popping candy, let's put that aside. The garbage bin. I'm at a playground, sorry. Uh, so no, came with it. Okay, so we're going to undo the uh, strap. Probably from a straight jacket. Who knows? You got out. So bonus strap. Just like those unboxing videos, most of this is extraneous rubbish going into the trash. <gasps> oh, not this though. Lightning rod. So zero. Okay. Show you painting. You can appreciate the artwork, and then I'll explain for you. I'm actually a children's playground, so this is going to have to be turned over right away. On the other side, it's got a nice picture of horses. Nobody will be offended with that. Two got me, Miss Vavoom, How, and Go Tintin high up with Stormy for his that. Hit night. Fortnite. Splash. Okay, Rod. So there's me and Rattler and Baristo Pool Falls, and this chick hops in. Splash. Miss Vavoom. A la Stormy, Texas, Natural Hot Springs, Black Forest. Well, definitely a keeper. And of course, I've got the scrolls. Scrolls are always a keeper. And oh, another one. Okay, so I didn't look at that side. I was looking at the printed side. I'm gonna have to hold it. Psst, okay, Rod, Rattler, 4K, Fourth Moon, 19. He knows about a rave I should be going to. I saw Digit done homages a la Norma J and thought I get a fine Stormy Texas. Plus 24 moons later, I was Baristo in walks Stormy Texas. So I thought that water pool in Stormy Texas plus Mocha plus sits on rocks by small fall at H2O. So fourth day I did it. Ziz Jose Wood. Stormy DD me, me calls me Miss Rattler because I got more curves than a pit of them. Pit, it's got more curves than a pit of rattlesnakes. It's a common, uh, there's a trope that he uses. See, this is much more interesting than opening a phone and going, oh, I opened a phone, I got a phone. I go, I go what the fuck is out here? Um, it's okay, huh? Crayola, Violet. That's gonna be garbage. Oh. Clearly, clearly, this is a masterpiece of folk art. We have a carved, handmade wooden pencil topped with an elephant and some rocks glued to the bottom. You can see there's a sort of almost a crystal, quartz crystal, uh, another piece of rock and a couple other rocks. It's like a, it's like a pencil on its own pencil stand. I'm gonna set, no place to set it down here for you. I'm sorry, you just have to appreciate it like this. You can appreciate it. You can see the mechanics of it and appreciate that gravity would actually do a bit of work and it would sit on a table. Amazing. That that is going to be the showpiece for the next edition. I've got a little ornamental um, pipe cleaner. I think it was used to wrap the scrolls. Hard to tell now. I got a ponytail holder used to wrap the scrolls. It's nice because you know all these things were well loved and well used before they ever made their way to me. Okay, so now the scrolls. This is what I like. Should I open the scrolls now or should I open the coffee cup still remaining because there's more scrolls in the coffee cup why don't we just get through all the shit first <clears throat> and open the scrolls last so another scroll with a bit of toilet paper that's the nice thing about stormy is sometimes it's used and sometimes it's fresh you never know we're gonna hope it's fresh all right so what do we got here oh this is a creamer this was guarding the end of the scroll but the creamer is done rod for Eve's grad, purse plus Korea gift to MM notebook, MM's gift, Admiral Nimitz, all homage, signed by Stormy Texas, Bessie. 
probably not his bank account number, I can't imagine. Anyways, it's kind of him to get something for Eve's crowd. Nice of you to remember. Okay, the coffee cup is empty. This is going into... We're going to use the coffee cup now as the trash receptacle for the dodgy food that I'm not going to eat and the other things. That's a crayon I'm not going to use. Um, the book is going to go into the free book bin behind me, Stormy. I'm sorry. Uh, at most, it's worth two cigarettes. You're not getting full back. This is the purse for Yi. Truly, she's going to love it. A little, a little Asian styled clutch with a notebook inside. Oh, a notebook. Yo. Oh, look at that. Bodhi book. Bodhi book. That looks like Stormy's writing, all right. Well, from Cuba. Um, Nelson just recently had its trash to Treasure Day. A lot of stuff was left out on the curb. You were welcome to go pick through it. Clearly some people did. They labeled it as artwork and brought it to me. Um, thank you Stormy. He's gonna love that. She's gonna be impressed. And the purse too. You never give somebody a purse without money in it. Do you know that Stormy? Bad luck. Anyways, I'll let her uh, fill it with cash or whatever she thinks fit. I'm unwrapping. Scroll number one. Now we're just down. Oh, no, there's a bit of paper on the end of this one. It's an old sandwich. Paper. Probably stormy out of sandwich. I'm at 11 minutes and 39 seconds. I'm sorry, guys, but I don't mean to bore you. It's taking that long. But the hell. But it's just a bit of sandwich paper. Going in the uh, garbage coffee cup. All right. Now we're on to. Uh, Scroll numero one. Dalaya Sifin Java and Burley plus class. Okay, so some artwork here. Apart from a course, it seems to be a mixture of photocopy and uh, mixed media. On the other side, the note. I'm gonna read the note. I know, no, Stormy Texas is gonna climb stone steps, okay? Clags. This is swamp. Miss Frile be dessert. And all you have to ask is, was edible jamas? Well, you're stupid. I don't get it. Can't really look at the other side of it again. I'm in a playground, there's children around. Thank you, Stormy, it's beautiful. I am amassing an amazing collection of art, thanks to you. It's always nice to get somebody's reaction when you like seeing people open gifts. Oh, what do you think? What do you think? Oh my God. Isn't it great? I made that for you myself. I do this all the time. I made it for you myself. You know, it's just nice seeing that sort of, I have to say something kind, but what? But what? Okay, so uh, I'm not even gonna look at the toilet paper. We'll just, seems to be clean. Don't need to know, don't need to know. Oh, this looks to be a few scrolls. Mm. Okay, so who's it got here? Okay. So Stormy's technique often involves him running to the um, Cowens, Nelson, and uh, printing, you know, off from magazines and things like that. Uh, probably got the tone of the magazines from the few pictures you've seen so far, which doesn't make him a darling of all the girls that work at Cowan's. They think he's a dirty old man. This is not true. He is an artist. He is in one of the best artists in the Kootenays. And what he's doing is, um, you know, setting the ground for his canvas. So, picture number one. I can show this in a playground. It's just fashion artists, no notes. Just a bunch of girls, old time Hollywood heroes. Thank you, Stormy. Oh, and I'm thinking that's gotta be a young Marilyn with a couple of cops. Probably that's, probably that's a young Stormy Texas in the background. He's always going in the back. It's hard to tell, can't recognize the face. It wouldn't surprise me in the least. Him and Marilyn were very close for a long time. And this is a little sort of super enlargement, dot matrix style. 
I'll be running. Kids trying to kill me with the soccer ball. I'm thinking, wondering if I'm going to notice. Wondering what the hell's this guy? And here's um. Looks like Marilyn getting married to somebody I don't know who. No text on any of those. Some suspicious stains on one, but probably just coffee. You never know what's going on. Okay, so that's uh, one, two, three. We're down to three. Could I get through this one? Oh, I didn't think I saw this one. Oh, another one of Oopsie Daisy. Bit of a wind here. Are we working? Are we working? Are we working? Are we working? Thank God this isn't live, huh? Banana show. This is a, it's a dog and pony show. There you go. See, you don't get. You rarely get this kind of cinematic excitement quality with those professional uh, YouTube vloggers. Okay, so next scroll. Not a playground scroll. Some text on the bottom and on the back. Two rod staff docking dot calf or baffle fair. Like he writes it as everyone knows. Who Anyways, bottom. Miss Del Sol flogs Stormy Texas's big blue angel, bubbly. Eight thousand dollars for a woody box of four. Ah, yeah, Stormy, look at me. Sa Tropez billion pulled up Maserati. Just two guys. Guys, I'm gonna get arrested for opening this shit in the playground. You know, this is gonna happen. It would serve me right. It would serve you right, buddy. You're killing me, Stormy. You're killing me. Oh, Miss 90, 40, 20, 30, a la Stormy Texas, May 19. Okay, so this is just a quick little sketch. What's well, apparently a nude woman. Lightly photocopied so that he could draw a bit around it and pretend he drew it himself. Greatest living artist in the community. Did I say that? I don't know if I said that. I'd like to underline that point right now. Next one. Oh, he's got the signposts. I love the signposts. Here's the signpost. Right there. Surrounding another indecent picture. Is that all a message in a bottle? Two lightning rods, this chick's in charge, crushing flat, mountain beer cans, and when uh, you do remember that etching, Nazi sub, when cruise ships see twill be fish line with glimmer in the moonlight. And the signs point towards the twilight zone, that's generally Nelson. Outer limits, which is I think uh, the east shore. Balfour fairies, spelt fairies, as in fairies, not, not fairy. I like bury the ship, bury the little bit of creatures. Miss Cheesy Toaster that refers to somebody who once gave him a grilled cheese sandwich, and that's how the nickname was applied, and it has haunted her ever since. I would take a nickname like Miss Grilled Cheese. I don't know how I got Lightning Rod, but she's known as Miss Grilled Cheese. Rod with pack of fags for Hobima Hank, aka me. Oh, somebody's a little short on cigarettes, I'm getting the feeling, huh? Somebody, two, two scrolls, two scrolls pleading for cigarettes and it was just popping in, checking if I'm there with a pack of bags. Poor guy. Oh, another one. See, the art does there. Sometimes he actually adds color to them and they, they're quite good, but. Is it? Mo, and Udap Lades, this sad gals, as a de whatever. For four dozen roll ups and once a two dozen more. Well, how come Stormy doing her again? I don't get it. Well, you're stupid. Holly Balloon, I got it. Miss Fry's got more curves than a pit full of rattlesnakes. Than rattles, yeah. It's like, it was kind of funny once, once I figured it out. It took me a bit of figuring out. 100 times. Okay, class, just use your clammy nugget. The good thing is, is being the best artist, a lot of artists like, you know, Leonardo da Vinci only ever did one Mona Lisa. He did do a few preparatory sketches and paintings that resembled it while he built up to it. So there are things close to it, but there is only one Mona Lisa. However, there are literally millions of stormy Texas scrolls. So when they ascend in value after his imminent death, I plan to kill him here. Um, 
everyone can have one. Everyone can have two or three. I'm hoarding them up. You'll want to buy them off of me. And we're reaching the end. Oh, neither side suitable for the playground. This side's a bit. No. You can sort of see what it might be. Mo, shut up, birdie. Look, is raining plus me 90. I bet gonna get in 10 sec stormy Texas to lick. Burr, um, ply. Miss 90, 40, 20, 30. Okay, R4 listing. List. Nin stormy Texas, cause you give fragile icon and bag with Norma Jean to hardware gal. Call Mr. Penguin suit for pickup. What? Oh, okay. Odds all. Okay, I'll bet 4 1 that hardware gal took Hemingway icon to quack crap. But if, if Lightning Rod got heart haywire, Dr. J to do pickup, then poof, the mundane parfait wake up, it'll be gone so. So that's the delivery. I'm apparently the last one I opened. Apparently, somehow in all this mess, there's a bunch of uh, scrolls I'm supposed to deliver to somebody. The icon, oh, those are probably the, the first, you know, color ones that I got. Um, well, this is, uh, the scrolls are all getting rolled together now. Assemble the uh, interesting assortment of treasures that I've received. Thank you, Stormy, again. I will have to reciprocate in kind. I could go into the bathroom and get a roll of toilet paper and sit down and start writing a long letter myself. It's hard to imagine getting even. In all fairness, I did give him my son. had given me a long, long time ago a penis-shaped play flute. It was an ocarina he picked up in the Dominican Republic. It was a little novelty thing that they sell to tourists. Shaped like a penis with balls. I gave it to Stormy and told him he could make a fortune busking in front of Oso with it. Which I think he might have tried to do. Um, <laughs> there's no telling. Anyways, well, mm, oh my god, all this loot. Time to take it all home. That's an unboxing video. That is exciting. Wasn't that amazing? Priceless artwork. Pencils, naked woman. I don't know why I'm missing aliens, but they occur in some of them. Okay, that's all for now.